everybody and welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Nicole and this is Cooking with Mrs. Carmub. Today I'm going to do something a little bit different. I just got done doing a haul to Meyer, and this is everything I got. I was literally in the store for two hours, you guys. Two hours. So let's get home, let's get this stuff unloaded, and let's check out what we got. So as we all know, the food prices have gone up. The gas prices have gone up. So what I am going to show you in today's video is how you really can stretch your dollar at the grocery store and shop the sales and really compare things. Okay, so we got everything unloaded and now I'm gonna show you exactly what I got and how it was a really good deal. So let's flip this camera around. Okay, this right here is a whole shoulder butt and it was on sale for 99 cents a pound, which is a really great deal. So I got a 17, almost 18 pound shoulder butt for, for only 17.69, you guys. So we can do that with pulled pork. We can put some, chop it up and make um, boneless pork chops out of it. So we're gonna do that. Um, the next really good buy I got was the cream soups. They were a doubt 10 for 10. So I like to stock up on my cream of chicken, my cream of mushrooms, and then we like the chicken noodle soup. So when we get sick, so got some of that. Um, they also had the Chef Boyardee cans 10 for 10. So I stocked up on those. Um, I'm also starting to stock up on my medicines and stuff when they're on sale because um, those are starting to get short just like everything else so they had band-aids on sale they had the alcohol prep pads they had the cortisone they had the cough drops and then i got some um, cough syrup uh, another one we got was the toothpaste that was also 10 for 10 so i got six of those the sandwich bags were the same thing I wanted to get the snack bags, but they were out of them. Chex Mix is really, really popular in our house. So when it's on sale, I try to buy it. Again, 10 for 10, so we stocked up on those. The movie theater popcorn. Um, this was also 10 for 10, and it's three bags per box. So I actually saved about $1.79 on four boxes rather than getting one box with 12 bags. Uh, the other thing was the rice a -roni. That was also a good buy. That was a 10 for 10. So I got four of those, or six of those, two, four, six, yeah. Um, beef broth, vegetable broth, chicken broth. I do try to keep that on hand. Um, I normally don't do the canned. I usually like to do it myself with the bouillon, but um, this was also on sale, 10 for 10, so I did that. Um, the eggs, they were 99 cents, so I got two dozen of those. And then we have our asparagus. Now it is March, it's the beginning of March, and we still have snow on the ground. So whenever asparagus goes on sale in Michigan in the winter months, I try to get it. This was a great snag, it was 99 cents a pound, so I got two of those. Cucumbers, also 10 for 10, three of those. And then, um, same thing with the sauerkraut, because it is March, St. Patrick's Day, that usually goes on sale, so I try to stock up on that. That freeze is awesome. Broccoli saw is good. That was also um, one of my buys, 10 for 10. And as I was browsing, I came across these two salad mixes, and I was like, oh, okay, 40% off, 40% off, so we got two pounds for just over four dollars you guys so i think all in all we did pretty good so we're gonna go downstairs and we're gonna put it in our rotating pantry so like i was saying before shop your ads it's really really important now because things are only gonna get worse before they get better you guys i got everything that i just showed you for just over two hundred dollars I did buy some stuff that I wasn't anticipating, 
but it was also on sale that I did not see in the ad. So make sure you check your ads, make sure you go online, make a list. That is the biggest thing I can tell you. Try to abide by a list. If you have digital coupons, use those. If you have paper coupons, use those. And hopefully you guys can get a nice big grocery haul like this and it won't break the bank. We're also starting our little food storage pantry downstairs and that will be in another video. So if you guys like this video today, please hit that like, smash that subscribe, leave a comment, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.